Intermolecular Force vs Covalent Bond by kscience.com Intermolecular forces are weak forces of attraction between molecules. Here are two water molecules, represented by dot and cross diagrams showing the outer electrons only. These red lines represent weak intermolecular forces. You must remember that intermolecular forces exist between the molecules. With intermolecular forces, there are no sharing of electrons. It is just a weak force of attraction that exists between molecules. Whereas, where these two outer shells overlap, this is a covalent bond. A covalent bond is between the atoms and they share a pair of electrons. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Let's now summarize the key differences between a covalent bond and an intermolecular force in this table. A covalent bond is between atoms, whereas an intermolecular force is between molecules. This dot and cross diagram is a hydrogen molecule and it points to the covalent bond, which is a shared pair of electrons between two nonmetal atoms. Whereas here are two hydrogen molecules and the arrow points to where the intermolecular force would be between the two molecules. In a covalent bond, a pair of electrons are shared, whereas in an intermolecular force, there are no electrons shared. Covalent bonds are strong and intermolecular forces are weak. Therefore, with covalent bonds, lots of energy is needed to break them, whereas with intermolecular forces, very little energy is needed to break them. Pause the video here to practice the keywords. The answers will follow. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. If stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. And don't forget to visit kscience.com for more videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe.